guys welcome back to my channel it's Camille also known as glam cam and this is a very special video that I am bringing to you guys today today I will be introducing my very first product that I will be launching in April 2021 and I am very very excited to bring this product to you guys I've been working on it for about a year now and I kind of started it on this channel when I gave you guys the DIY recipe of making a scalp butter on my channel um, so I kind of took that and I evolved it into an actual product with amazing amazing ingredients in it I have put literally every butter in it I have put um, very high-end oils in it. it is even infused with some amazing amazing herbs and it is a very very special product for me um, I've, a lot of people have tried it and I've only gotten great reviews from it so it will be coming soon to you guys um, so I will be showing you guys um, my product my official product and I will be demonstrating um, how I use the product on my hair and I will be embarking on what I call the herbal butter challenge so the product is called herbal butter and it is a butter infused with beautiful beautiful herbs such as rosemary sage calendula red rose petals green tea and peppermint literally infused right into the product i have very special oils in it rose hip oil jojoba oil grapeseed sweet almond rice bran oil which has squalene in it very good for skin and hair um and other oils guys this is a great product like i literally have every butter a lippy butter, kapuaku butter, marumaru butter, shea butter, cocoa butter, avocado butter, mango butter, and more like coconut butter. I have literally all all the butters you could think of. Um, this is a non-comedogenic butter, so I use it directly on my face. You can use it on your body. You can use it on your feet heels. You can use it on your knuckles. You can use it on your eczema. You can use it on your acne. It's amazing, amazing butter. Literally, my brand. So. Let me back up my brand is called tonic essentials guys and tonic meaning anything invigorating spiritually um health wise morally um and essentials is anything that's you know something that's important that's a chief point in your life something that you know you rely on and so for my brand to be called tonic essentials i want to provide products that are tonic they're helpful they're beneficial and they're essential in people's lives so that is the basis of my brand that is the type of products that i'm trying to bring to market um my butter being the first very first product um that represents my brand represents a tonic essential um being that it is a universal butter that you can use all over your body and has amazing health benefits or amazing you know qualities in it, amazing beneficial herbs and vitamins in it that literally it can help from your hair scalp to your hair to your hair strands to your body your face whether you have dry skin oily skin normal skin it all works so so good i've had people with different skin types different hair types try this butter and i've only gotten good reviews guys and whatever critique i took i literally took that and i made the butter even better from it so this is it so i'm gonna be showing you guys let me show you guys my box my amazing graphic designer made this box and it is a graphic of um the the essential oils that i have in this butter so i have um i believe this is elangi lang flowers i have lavender essential oil in it i have um geranium geranium oil in it and i have one more essential oil uh lavender geranium lemongrass so i have lemongrass um the actual plants or flowers printed into this beautiful graphic that um, will be my shipping boxes. So yeah, so this is the actual product guys. My herbal butter, my herbal butter guys. Um, let me, if the camera will focus. So this is the jar. This is tonic essentials, herbal butter, all purpose moisture butter all-purpose meaning you use it all over your body I have the ingredients back here very long list of amazing amazing ingredients only beneficial ingredients this is preserved by a natural preservative I have flatlate free fragrances in here so they are not irritable whatsoever um, and I tell you how to care for this so it is a butter um, it is a it is a it is a sturdy butter so it won't necessarily like melt as soon as it gets a little warm but you do want to keep it um, 
at 70 degrees Fahrenheit and if it does melt you want to put it in a room temperature room so it will solidify back up but this is a very moisturizing butter it's not too tough um and I'm just really I'm really happy for this I'm really happy that I was able to get it in the jar that I imagined with the labeling design that I imagined and to give off the aesthetic that I was aiming for so this is a very special product for me me I being the maker of this product I will be using this six ounce jar that is not yet that will not yet be ready to launch. I will only be starting with a three ounce jar just to give people a taste of how amazing this product is. And then I will start selling a six ounce jar. So this is kind of just um, a research and development um, prototype. Anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling, but I just want to introduce, introduce you guys to my official product. I have the herbal butter here. We have a eucalyptus scent. We have, we have a jasmine, oh well this is original, this is fragrance free, you only smell, guys the cocoa butter I use literally smells like a chocolate bar, I, I, direct source, sustainably source, cocoa butter, shea butter, um, everything, so this is what it's looking like, sorry guys, it's taking a long time to adjust, so this is the butter, very tough, not very oily, and all the butters literally kind of just sink right into your skin. I also have Jamaican black castor oil in this, so obviously it is good for your scalp. So I have Original, which is fragrance free. I have Eucalyptus, which is a very popular scent. And I have Jasmine. I also have Vanilla, but I haven't made Vanilla yet because I ran out of ingredients. All in all, um, I am rambling. Sorry about that, guys. So I'm going to get into this video. What I am going to do, this is how my hair has been kind of like most of the time since I cut it just out um, or in twists. Uh, I just I usually wear it in a scarf when I wear it up like this but because I'm gonna be doing my hair today I took that off so I'm gonna go and wash condition I'm gonna detangle wash and condition my hair with also my products I won't be using um, any commercial products today in this video for demonstration purposes but I will not be showing you guys what I'm washing with because they're still in the wraps, they're still under wraps. So I'll only be showing you guys the herbal butter because this product is ready for market and it will be sold. Um, right now it is available for pre-order, so please go ahead to tonicessentials.com and pre-order your butter today. Today, guys. So I'm gonna talk about more about the herbal butter challenge when I get back from washing my hair. So I'm gonna go wash my hair and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I have washed my hair. I'm about to do a mini lock method. Let's look. Let us see the detangled hair. Y'all saw how it was looking before. It was looking crazy. I had to seriously detangle it. So today I'm going to be doing a twist out with my butter and a few other of my products that have not been released yet. So I am going to do a lock method with um, some of my products. So I do have an oil that I will let you guys see. And I have a leave-in conditioner that I am kind of you know working on so i will be using that as well and then i'll be using the butter as like my curl cream my sealant things like that so i'm going to start in the back and i'm going to try to hurry up and um seal in the moisture from all of my hair before it dries out so i'm going to just do the oil and leave in all throughout my hair and then come back and start twisting this is my oil i'll speed through this So one thing I will say about my hair, um, since the curly hairstyle is cut my hair while it was curly, it's not like all the way even to the ends all throughout my head. And I want to say that isn't really a problem, but I'm starting to think that it might be a little bit of a problem just because if, um, if some strands end up here and some strands end up here, all of this area is going to be like bushy because you know the ends is where your hair gets like your hair starts shrinking and stuff so it kind of gets like bushy and even more bushy because it's all different lengths um all the way to the end so i may have to blow dry my hair and give it a really good trim just so that everything is like even to the to the very ends so that i kind of experience less bushiness or less shrinkage um that's an experiment for me so i will consider that
Okay, so I did this lock in the, the lock method all throughout my head with oil and a leave-in. Now I am going to be using the butter to start doing the twist out. Now one thing I want to do is have some straight parts. So I'm going to get a comb and actually part the back and part all of the twists to make them really neat. Okay, before I actually start, I do want to do a link check because like I said, I am doing an herb and butter challenge. So I will be documenting the starting point and then I will be documenting the end point in another video. So we're going to take the back corner of this and I'm going to get some tape. Okay, got some measuring tape. So I took the back corner. Um, so it's currently here and now we're going to do measuring tape I'm going to get it right up at the root so right there so that's six about six and a half inches. And um, I'm not gonna get the other side, just assume that it's also six and a half inches. So I have my butter. And what I'm gonna do, I'm actually gonna grease the part with the butter because it's great for scalps, great for hair growth. I'm gonna go ahead and grease the part. Make sure that my scalp is moisturized. And I think I'm just gonna do two twists in the back. So I'm gonna take some of the butter. And butter. So one thing I do want to note is how unruly my hair is. Like once I give it a position to stay trained in, it will literally mold into that, especially on the ends. The ends will, will be like so bushy, but like what, like a day and some twists, they're like calm as ever. So like, I'm going to put a little bit of butter on the ends. Give them some extra security. And also one thing I did notice about the butter, because of the weight, it is great for for kinky hair, especially low porosity hair. Um, the butter does have aloe vera juice in it as well as some glycerin, so it does attract moisture while sealing in hydration, which is literally so perfect, perfect combination for low porosity hair. Okay, this is going to get boring, but I do want to show you guys um, towards the end what I kind of did, which is pretty straightforward. I'm going to part my hair and I'm going to grease the section, grease the part with the butter as well as coat the strands in the butter for um, to hold the twist. So I'm going to do this off camera because this is boring and the video is going to be so long, but I will be back when I get towards the end. I am gonna, with a shortcut, I do have a bang, so I am gonna try to um, pull out that bang and do some twists for the bang. So I will be back. Okay guys, so I have done a little bit more than half of my hair. I have this and this amount left, but I just wanted to show you guys like how my ends are looking. My hair is pretty much dry up here, so I'm going to re-wet it and put some butter on and twist it and just show you guys the transformation. Uh, let me zoom out. So I'm gonna take some of the butter. Now it's gonna take a little bit because, like I said, a lot of you know natural hair is very moldable. So when you don't have it in a certain mold, it will just be super unruly. So like my ends are just what I call unruly, right? So but the butter 
as you can see in these ends, they definitely keep the ends more defined, more, you know, just organized in my opinion. And the butter is a great type of like catalyst to help mold your hair or I don't know if catalyst is the right word, but it definitely helps mold your hair or I guess um, tame it. And I can tell that when I put my butter in and I twist my hair up, um, after a few minutes or so, the butter starts to seep into the strands and thus, like, you know, sufficiently hydrating and moisturizing my hair. Like, I'm not trying to hype this up. This shit is the bomb. So, ends are looking crazy, but as I put the butter on, it's becoming more and more softer. Um, gotta do a little finger detangle. And then it really starts to like soften up. So I'm gonna start twisting. And what I really like about the butter is literally just butter oil, butter and oil, a little bit of wax. Like no other harsh chemicals, nothing like that. It's literally just butter and oil. So like you really can't go wrong with that in herbs. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, take some butter, rub it on the ends, and I'm going to take this comb and just calm it down. And so now I am able to twist it all the way down. It's no longer bushy, right? And so you let that sit and after a while, you like feel that your hair has molded into that position and it's now it's no longer unruly you feel me take some butter put it on the ends work it up you get you to spray a little bit more water on the ends just so that it's more receptive to the butter Okay, I'm back and I'm done. I have done the entire head. This is how I was looking. Yeah, so, um, oh my gosh, excuse that. Yeah, so, um, this is how it's looking. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna let this sit for about a day or two. I may let it sit longer. I plan on being lazy unless I need to take them out to go somewhere and look nice. That's when I'll take that out and that's when I'll be back to show you guys how it looks as a twist out. And yeah, we can reconvene then. So <laughs> see you guys then. Okay guys, I am back. It has been like a week. It has been a week. I've had these twists in for a week. When I tell you guys, I don't do anything but keep this hair in some type of style that's what I mean and I'm happy my hair is happy so I'm actually gonna take it out and wear the twist out um, so I am gonna show you guys how I refresh my twist um, throughout the week with the butter as well and then I'm going to take out the twist and we will see the final look okay okay so when you refresh your hair or when you're you know refreshing your hair re-moisturizing it it's pretty simple i have a video where i show you guys how i oil my scalp it's pretty much the same process except without oil i'm using the butter um i'm definitely going to start off with some water and i want to spray the scalp as well as a little bit of the hair i don't want it too damp because i don't want my hair to frizz up when i take out the twists but i do want to um you know just bring them back to life so that you know if they got flat while i was sleeping on them that um, they spring back into their form. So, <laughs> that makes sense. So, I'm going to be using the butter. Um, so, basically all I'm going to do, since I did use, um, since I did part my hair in straight parts, I'm just going to go ahead and apply it into the scalp. And 
And this butter has Jamaican black castor oil in it. It has jojoba oil, rosehip oil. It has shea butter, mango butter, cocoa butter, kokum butter, alipi butter, marumaru butter, kapuasu butter. <sighs> it's the bomb. It's infused with rosemary, guys. Like natural herbs, natural butters, natural oils, all at your fingertips in one product. So, um, I think I lightly dampened the hair. I'm gonna just spray it one little time, especially the ends. Take some of the butter. And just squeeze it on in there and this is like the best way to take care of your hair when it's in twist and you're moisturizing it in the twist it definitely locks in the moisture with the hair being stuck together Ooh, I'm gonna spray this one Okay, I'm gonna give it like 10 minutes or so just so that the dampness can dry a little bit and then I'm going to take them down. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take them out one by one. So this is it guys. This is the twist out. I love it. Like when I said that uh, I didn't want to pick it apart too much because I didn't want to get to I didn't want it to get frizzy. I didn't even have to worry about that. I've been picking it apart and it still has the definition that I need. You feel me? So literally I don't know if I'll ever use another product for my twist out. This is perfectly fine for me. The hair is soft, it's fluffy. It's defined, it's moisturized, it's lengthened, it's frolicky. I'm happy. So guys, this is how your twist outs, you know, results will vary. But this is in general how the twist outs work with the butter. You can literally pre-order this butter right now at tonicessentials.com. Follow it on social media. Follow it at Tonic Essentials on instagram and i will be releasing the launch date which will be sometime in april i will start posting in march so i really want you guys to be up to date you can also subscribe to our mailing list on tonicessentials.com i really hope you guys um, do try this product out um let me know what you guys think about this turnout in the comments and let me know when you guys plan on you know trying your butter and partaking in the uh, herbal butter challenge guys Please get the butter so you can partake in the Herbal Butter Challenge if you have any rashes, any eczema, any ball patches, um, you want to, you know, work on your hair growth, you want to clear your acne up, use the butter twice a day for 30 days, 30 to 60 days. I promise you, you'll find some type of, you know, difference, amazing results. Um, yeah, guys, try this butter out. I, I really don't know what else to say. So I'm really excited to be introducing this product to you guys, introducing my brand to you guys. Um, you will be seeing more of it on my channel. Um, go ahead to tonicessentials.com, pre-order your butter, sign up for the mailing list, like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel. Tonic Essentials is up, baby, it's up, it's coming up. Y'all heard it first, so stay tuned. Check out the results, guys. Look at the moisture. Look at the moisture. I've had these twists in for a week. 
Use it for anything. Use it for makeup primer. Use it to refresh your curls. Use it to grease your scalp. Use it to seal in moisture. Use it on your body. Everything, guys. I tell you guys, this is really it. I am so, so excited. And it only goes up from here, guys. It only goes up from here. So... I'm out, guys. Thanks for tuning into this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.